Meg's going to read us this book that she made, a Thanksgiving book, and it's all about the story of the first Thanksgiving and how it came to be. She the Thanksgiving story, written and illustrated by Meg H. Good, hon. Meg H., the mean king. The mean king of England made everyone go to his church. There he is right there. No! You'll see a back to that. You can meet. Oh, no, not that. Meg H. Holland. The pilgrims moved to Holland. Then they heard about America. The windmill That's in windmill. Holland. That's good, Meg. I thought windmills were brown or gray or black, not pink. Meg H. Mayflower. The pilgrims left England on the Mayflower. In 66 days, they landed in Plymouth Rock, at Plymouth Rock. Here's the ship coming up from the waves, the starting of it, and here's the sail. Good, huh? Oh, there it is. Okay. I made two along with a mustache, I decided to make beer. Okay. Did you get to the pictures that you illustrated on the back side? No. Okay. Make it just the Pilgrim back. Girls. Pilgrim Girls helped rock. Rock. Washed clothes and sewed. They helped dip clothes too. Candles, I think it Candles. was. Candles. Mm -hmm. Right. Now this is a picture that the teacher especially liked. Is this the one, Meg? Yes. She's got a pilgrim girl here, and then but this was I Megan's love own idea. And, back. and she's got the back of the pilgrim girl's head there. I'm going to save this book forever now because okay, I think it's just right great. There. And the teacher made a comment on there about how the she thought it was Indians, interesting that Meg did Indians that. Indians were friendly. They sewed this, what's H, S, H, O, W, E, D, spelled? Showed. Showed the pilgrims how to plant, hunt, and fish. Great, huh? Now, the end. that was the end of it. Oh, that was very good, Meg. I want to show you something. We made a CCD. Um, we made a turkey right here and put some stuff. It's a place now. Oh, it's and a And then place on the now. other side, I just drew something yesterday. Oh, that's nice. And now, then, can you read it for us? Does say it has some words there? This little boy caught it. He says, I got it. And then after that, he cried. Very good, Katie. And here's mine. That's what you made it But she did. didn't have anything on the back of it. Uh-huh. Yes. Now, wait a second. And here's something special that I made by a story. Oh, well, it's very nice. Now, I want you girls to tell me about your birthday. for Tommy. You Tommy just wanted to make a new house. Uh huh. He made windows, chimneys, mm -hmm. a doorstep, and grass. It looks like a cat, honey. I know. He went over to Sally's house to show. There's the S for Sally. And she decided to put on her bonnet and go down to have apples. Sally figured out that it was raining. They got up and they slipped. 
that they tried to Oh, did the teacher do this? The teacher told you this little and story and you did this? Slipped. You illustrated no, they it? Made it up. And they got up and they slipped and then they got up and went to the No, Mrs. Randall. That's Mrs. very Randall. good, Megan. Now, these two girls just had their seventh birthday recently, a couple of weeks ago, and they had lots of parties to celebrate because they had the birthday table at school where you go up and get ice cream if it's your birthday, that month I guess it is, and then they had a party here at home with just our immediate family, plus grandma and grandpa, Nan and Bumpa we call them, and then they had separate parties. Megan had a party where she had friends come over and the magician entertained and we ate pizza and Katie's party is yet to be because we wanted to spread the parties out a little bit and Katie's party is next Monday and she is taking about six of her friends to see Prancer a new Christmas movie out this year. Is that a Disney movie? Yeah! What do you want in it? Okay, now I would like to get Lewis in a picture.